Uh, I'm Aisha Essen. Um, uh, I'm a working mother. I have an eight-year-old kid and I've been working for the past 10 years or so. Do you think that you have to kill the girls in Karachi? Yeah, just like everywhere else in the world, but yeah, it happens over here. क्या एज ग्रुप आपको लगता है टीनेजर ज्यादा करते हैं या थर्टीज फोर्टीज के लोग ज्यादा करते हैं या फिर बाबों का प्रॉब्लम है आई थिंक इन ऑल एज ग्रुप्स यू सी दिस द यंगर द टीनेजर्स दे डू इट बिकॉज़ इट मेक्स देम लुक कूल एंड देन द बाबे जो हैं वो दे डू इट बिकॉज़ दे आर एक्चुअली रियली फ्रस्ट्रेटेड यू नो दे आर पास्ट थर्टीज और फोर्टीज दे प्रोबब्ली हैवेंट हैड इनफ ऑफ द गुड थिंग्स एंड द फ्रस्ट्रेटेड सो या इन एवरी एज ग्रुप यू फाइंड दैट कभी आपके साथ कुछ ऐसा हुआ है या किसी के साथ होते हुए देखा है कैन यू प्लीज शेयर दैट वेल या आई हैव हर्ड ऑफ अ लॉट ऑफ गर्ल्स एट वर्क प्लेस एंड अदरवाइज दे हैव कंप्लेंट अबाउट गाइस चेकिंग देम आउट एंड हाउ इट मेक्स देम अनकंफर्टेबल एंड वेल व्हाट आई टेल देम इज दैट गाइस विल चेक यू आउट इट्स दैट्स अ रियली बैड थिंग टू से दैट वी हैव सॉर्ट ऑफ accepted this part of our society but the guys will check you out and it's up to you to be so strong and so thick skinned that you don't it that it doesn't really affect you keep moving on you know you keep moving on let them check you out you keep doing your work and um eventually the losers will realize that they're not getting any that way so um that is what i think is the right thing to do because most women when guys check them out they get intimidated they get scared they they just go back into the shell and that makes the men more happier they they feel that hey you know i'm so strong i got that women intimidated but that's the thing don't let the bully win hum for example leke chale chale wo apne shell mein band hi hoti hain bada confident ho ke react karna chahti hain to family ka system society ka system hamare mulk ka law ya police aapke is reaction ko support karegi to a certain degree you can complain but not that much because for example agar aap ghari ke mahol ko dekhein if you tell your parents you tell your mother you know you have your confidence since you were a kid ke mujhe mera my chacha or my cousin is checking me out the mother will come after you they'll say there's something wrong with you you know that's not a good thing um it, it's your fault you it's something wrong with you so you can't really complain complain to anybody right unless and until the the situation is like that of a rape or really high level sexual harassment type ka but if a guy is checking you out you can't really tell anybody that's the dilemma that's a really bad thing but that is why i think it's the women should be educated to 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 know that you can build a wall you can build a fence a protective fence so that even if a guy is making you uncomfortable you can move on किस किस्म के एरियाज में आपको लगता है ये लिटरेसी का प्रॉब्लम है क्या बहुत एजुकेटेड लोग जो होते हैं वो नहीं करते ऐसा कुछ है आई डोंट थिंक सो वेल एजुकेटेड वंस माइट हैव द मैनर्स टू डू इट इन अ वे कि जो इतना ऑबवियस ना हो बट यू नो दिस इज अ पार्ट दिस इज एन अ रियली सैड डिप्रेव पार्ट ऑफ आवर सोसाइटी दैट मेन थिंक इट्स ओके टू चेक आउट वुमेन वेदर दे आर फ्रॉम द रियली पीएचडी काइंड ऑफ अ बैकग्राउंड और दे आर lay people so they know that this is part of the society and that's wrong uh ye to sahi baat nahi hai but the thing is ke iske liye you can't really complain you can't change it's not easy to change the system you know you tell the police who's the police is a guy you tell your mother as i said she'll come after you that oh maybe she didn't raise you well or something so you can't really complain you have to fight within yourself and i feel maybe maybe i'm wrong about this theory but if more women over time become so stronger ke you know it not affect now on in their school eventually the bullies will go away these are bullies the guys checking you out like common bullies right how do you deal with bullies you don't give them that attention eventually they'll just fizzle out i think i don't know if that will happen but i feel that's one of the situation the one way of dealing with what do you think koi severe kind ki mental illness hai ya sirf apni enjoyment ke liye aisa karte hain mental illness yeah it's 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 part of our culture it's really it is a part of that and um, isko agar aap mental illness ke hain ya isko aap tradition ke hain that's up to you but yeah that's what it is it's up to you how how you want to call it 
And you see it in the movies, in our songs, in our poetry, in our ancient poetry, the songs of my Purana Zaman, and Sapne Yata Chalar. You know, you listen to Ghalib, Ghalib bhi yehi baate karta hai, it's okay to do all these things. So it's really a part of the culture and that's, the, that's why it's really hard to fight it. Ghalib and Ahmed Faraz are for a particular girl. Yeah, but it's really still they're objectifying a woman. They're doing it in a really cool way using great words and literary, but they're still objectifying a woman, you know. So I'm just, that's my theory, might not be right, but I'm just saying that it's part of our culture. In, 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 in every um, layer of our culture, in every culture, in all culture, you can find that. In the world, you will be able to travel to the world. Is it just a problem of the Pakistan? No, not at all. I mean, I've traveled, I, I, I sort of grew up in America and I've, I've seen that it happens over there. You know, you go clubbing when you're young, guys check you out. So one of the worst kind of guys who, who are the worst are the white fraternity boys in the universities over there. They are the worst. The, the Pakistani kids, the Pakistan kids, they're poor guys, they have nothing. Those men, they think they own the world. You know, they're white, they're boys, they own the world, they're part of the, the upper spectrum of the society. So yeah, you see it everywhere in the world. This is also one reason that girls don't have to be educated about this. Girls and girls too. It's a very patriarchal society, you know. Like, when you come to the house, when you're young, you're a girl, you're going to have a father and you're going to have a father. You know, it's that kind of a society we're living in. So we raise our boys. Definitely, there are issues that we raise them to, and we tell them that it's okay to play around with girls. But then at the same time, we, get the, we tell the girls that, hey, you're going to be played. So you better cover up. When we tell our women to cover up, we're basically telling them there's something wrong with you. You need to cover it up. So yeah, it's part of our society. And that's why I'm saying it's so difficult to get out of it. And that child will listen to all this. So in his mind, it will come that this thing is covered. Yeah, exactly. If you're covering something, then it means that that's something you need to uncover. And that makes it more exciting. I mean, that's something you need to uncover. And that makes it more exciting. You, I'm not defending that boy, but at the same time, you have to understand his makeup because he always grew up thinking that the women needs your sisters, your brothers, your cousins, all these, they need to be covered up. Why? He wants to find out. He's curious. And that's the problem. I'm not saying that women should walk around, you know, uncovered all the time and everything. I mean, they should dress up the way they want to dress up. I'm not saying that, but I'm just saying that the emphasis on modesty in our society is actually a big problem as well. The emphasis. Comment ko to respond nahi kar sakte. Lekin iski wajah se aap khud bhi to limit ho rahe. Aap raat 10 12 baje ke baad nikal nahi sakte. Aap ek khaas libas nahi pehen sakte jo aap LA mein pehen sakte hain ya phir Thailand mein bhi pehen sakte. Lekin yahan nahi pehen sakte. To uska asar to pad raha hai aur ladki ki life pe pad raha hai. Usko easy to nahi le sakte. Nahi isko easy nahi le sakte. But the thing is ki wahi main keh rahi hu na ki bachpan se hame modesty ka itna lecture diya jata hai ki a good woman is a modest woman. A woman needs to look after, you know, ghar ki izzat hai and all that thing. That is the point. That's the thing that's causing all this issue down the road. Just say, I'm not going to be talking checking out a girl can eventually lead to a rape because mindset ho jata The mindset starts from there, actually. The families need to change. The culture needs to change. And I'm sure, you know, one of those free societies, just say, Brazil, they have a lot of these issues. Wow, they have a lot of issues. They have a lot at 1 o'clock at night, walking at night. I mean, when I was in New York, we can't really walk around at 1 o'clock at night. I would be scared even over there. Maybe because I was brought up like this. Whatever, I was scared. But I'm saying that that is just the problem, that we are told to, to be modest. And the guys want things that, okay, you know, that's candy for us. Yeah? Assalamu alaikum. I am Sabine Ava. Please don't forget to subscribe to Mere Log.